Asian card. Today I have my Legendary Collection 5Ds to open up for you guys. I just received this in the mail today in the morning. Uh, of course, this was officially released yesterday as of uh, October 24th. Uh, as you can see, it will include a Shooting Star Quasar Dragon, if you did not know, which is an awesome reprint in here. Uh, give you a look at the sides, you say, with the Dual Runner, and yeah. And on the back, so if you guys want to go ahead and read that, go ahead and pause the video. And let's go ahead and crack this open. Uh, definitely a lot of awesome cards to pull out of this that I'm hoping for. And just figured it'd be a pretty fun opening. And since it was one of the newer products to open for you guys, I figured I'd get it. Also, I'll be planning to get like maybe one of, or at least hoping to get uh, anything that's coming out in the future. So I'll be purchasing one of either of that stuff. So yeah. So inside we have our promo pack and let's go ahead and get everything out first and we should have yep our game board is right here so set everything else off to the side and let's take a look at the game board on this side we have the 5d's crew right here and it says leisure collection 5d's looks pretty awesome and on the other side we have the three nordic gods as you guys can see and Leave two of the Earthbound Mortals, so yeah. So, go ahead and set this off to the side. But pretty awesome that they include that as well as a little bonus. And of course we have our five packs right here, which look awesome. And our promo pack, so let's go ahead and take a look and see what the promos are. Or get a closer view of them. Alright. So we have... A Jormungardr, the Nordic Serpent. I think that's how you pronounce it. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong. But uh, yeah, pretty awesome card. If you want to read that, please be sure to pause the video as well. Next we have a Fenrir, the Nordic Wolf. Looks awesome. A Stardust Flash, another new card. Black Rose Dragon, Ultra Rare. Very awesome reprint. Definitely a very good card. And the Shooting Quasar Dragon, the star of this. So yeah. So we'll go ahead and set our promos up here, I guess, just because they're awesome. And this time around, we only do get five promos, so it's kind of like a tin in my opinion. And let's go ahead and start opening our packs. All right. Kind of want to open this carefully, if we can. In the first pack, we have a Red Dragon Archfiend, common. It's pretty interesting. I believe all the Signer Dragons come as common or ultra in the set as well. And we have a Moon Dragon Quilla, so getting quite a few synchros already. Uh, bl Black Return. Our rare is Level Eater. A Fallen Angel of Roses for ultra rare. Not the best ultra rare, but I'll take it. Super Nimble Mega Hamster as our secret. And a Super Mech Lord Emperor Granny. Next we have Mara of the Nordic Alfair and a Blackwing Backlash. So go ahead and move our packs off to the side and separate our rare, all our foils. Next pack. Hopefully this will open easily or not. Alright, so from what I can see, I believe these two should be commons. So we have a Red Screen, Nitro Synchron, Junk Ford, Dark Strike Fighter, Reprint. Uh, I believe they fixed the text on this to be once per turn. A uh, rare is Shield Wing, an Ultra Rare Advanced Draw, Secret Rare TG Werewolf, looks pretty interesting, and a Super Rare Black Wing Silverwind the Ascendant. Oh, and we have a Black Wing a Atessian of the two swords, so I guess it depends on each pack for if it's two or three. Just rip this pack then. So we have Offering to the Immortals, Black Back, Blackwing Kalima the Hay, so quite a lot of black wings. I believe that was three commons, so we should have Lifestream Dragon, common, 
junk blade are common. I believe that the rest should just be foils. So yeah, so we have Violet Witch as a rare, an ultra rare Vanitas of the Nordic Ascendant, secret rare Ancient Sacred Wyvern looks pretty awesome, and a super rare Earthbound Immortal Asla Pisku. Next pack, we have two packs left. Hopefully we can pull something awesome. So we have a Raptor Wing Strike, Revival of the Mortals. Alright, so we have Hyper Synchron, Avenging Knight Parshaft, common, and Junk Defender, common as well. So this was our rare. We have an Ultra Rare, <laughs> Blackwing Gladius, the Midnight Sun, definitely not a good Ultra in my opinion. Secret Rare, Mechlord, Astro Dragon, Asterisk, and a Super Rare Rose Archer, which is pretty cool. So, kind of lackluster pull so far. Maybe this last pack will turn everything around. So, let's see what we can get. Uh, just might pick up a few more of these, just because it's a, definitely an awesome set, and we'd like to hope uh, to pull something good out of it. Alright, so we have a tuning common. Now the reprint of that. Dark Resonator. Alright, so for the rest of the comments, we have Blackwing Elf and the Raven. Extra Valor. I believe the last card should also be a common. Hyper Synchron again. So Crimson Fire was our rare. We have an Ultra Rare Black Whirlwind. Secret Rare Tanks near of the Nordic Beasts. And another Blackwing and Silverwind DSN. So overall, not the greatest pulls, but not too bad, I guess. Definitely could have hoped for better. But again, just decided to open this because it was the new item. And yeah. So for a recap, we have Crimson Fire, Nordic Relic. Violet Witch, Shield Wing, and Level Eater for our rares. For our foil, uh, supers, we had Blackwing, Silverwind, The Ascendant, Times 2, Rose Archer, Earthbound Moro, Asla Pisku, McLord Emperor Granul, Black Whirlwind as our Ultra, as well as the this guy, Vanitas, Advanced Draw, and Fallen Angel of Roses. So, not the best Ultras. Secrets, we had Tanks near, McLord, Astro, Dragon. Ancient Sacred Wyvern, TG Warwolf, and Super Nimble Mega Hamster. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that opening. And please be sure to hit the like button as well as subscribe and share the video if you want. So yeah, so thanks for watching and Azing Card out.